That's in the letter. Welcome all the international and local uh, visitors. As, as you all know, this is the time the migration starts uh, coming from Tanzania to Kenya. It is the best time for our visitors to come and witness and experience for the next uh, <clears throat> uh, next five months uh, to October. This year is going to be better than 2019. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe it is going to be 90% and it's affordable. So we, we, we tell our fellow <coughs> countrymen to come and enjoy. But with the new government, it took uh, 
Governor, His Excellency will in two to three months to first a management plan. So as the managers of this reserve, we will be using the plan to put everything in place. So it will guide us in all areas. For now, we, we have uh, completed 200 uh, uh, kilometers of roads, new roads. We did uh, uh, the, the usual roads, old roads. We have an uh, enforcement team in place. We have enough vehicles. So throughout the crossings, we have our men there to enforce uh, to our, uh, law and order. Since the new government came, we, the motivation of our uh, staff is there. We have uh, new firearms. So protection of our visitors is paramount. And we are up to the tax. We have, we have a force of about uh, 387 men and women. I have seen buffalo and cheetahs and, and hyena and zebras and, and giraffe. We have seen the number of, uh, the increase in the number of uh, wildlife. We have seen the number, the increase in terms of the value of the tourists who comes here. We are talking about also declaration of Masai Mara as a, a World Heritage Site. These processes are in place and next year, even starting this year, you will see a total different Mara game reserve, a total different greater Mara ecosystem and hopefully we'll be able now to create the long lost uh, migration routes, uh, open up more migration corridors, more conservation areas to bring back Mara to where it was uh, in the beginning. We have seen animals and then we have seen airplanes. Learning very many. In fact, the, the, I've got a chance to see the, the, the explorer wild beasts coming uh, as it's introducing other wild beasts. It's been a, been a very nice experience. Actually, I would wish to advise many teachers not to stick in class. Let them bring learners here, experience uh, the rich heritage we're having in our country. And even the Masai Mara, they learn a lot. Actually, a lot and experience very many things out of class. Wanaeza kununua ushangahizi ambazo zinakuza utamaduni ambayo ni wa Masai wa hapa Narok County. Uh, wazazi wetu ama wa mama walio hapa, wanapata kitu ambacho wanaweza the communities around the Masai Mara are very interesting. We have really enjoyed the, getting familiar with the culture and with the people. The people are so friendly and beautiful and they are happy and we have just really enjoyed our experience here all around. I would tell them that do whatever you can to come here and experience this. We just came yesterday. So the, on the way coming here, we heard that um, uh, the wild, wild beasts are moving and uh, we were very excited and we are here to witness that one. Hopefully before we go, we'll see a good migration. Okay, this is a once in a lifetime experience for anybody. Unless you, uh, most of them cannot afford to come every year. But uh, at least in once in their lifetime, they should come and witness uh, what is there in Ma Masai Mara. And the, the village and the people, the way the hospitalization, I mean hospitality is very good. We are expecting them to cross in big numbers. Yes, so um, it's a nice experience. Clans are full in the Mara, all over. You know, this is uh, the biggest attraction of tourism in the country. I have seen elephants, giraffes, wild animals. I was happy, I was fine, it was so fun.